Our, um, there's, there's some events that Bob has at the TU Center that you may not realize it, but they are big numbers, and I've seen them firsthand. One of them is ECAC Hockey. Right. I know they're in Atlantic City now, Bob. Will they ever be back here? Uh, actually, we've been asked to do a presentation and submit a bid okay. for uh, 14, 15, and 16. They're in uh, 13, they're in Atlantic City one more year. Okay. Um, whether or not Atlantic City and they decide to stay there for that year, or if they want to maybe try to go out and either come back here or go to Lake Placid or go somewhere else. Uh, I think that that's up in the air. Even though there's a contract, maybe there's some discussions they can have. Um, we're going to try to get it back 14, 15, 16. We're submitting a bid. Uh, we would like to have it back in 13. You know, if it could come back and they can work out their issues with Atlantic City. Uh, we're centrally located. That's the key. People that are traveling to that tournament, if you're in Clarkson or St. Lawrence and you're way up north, or if you're in Cornell and Colgate out west, mm. mid, middle part of this, uh, New York State, you're not going to want to travel, or even Dartmouth, you're not going to want to travel to Atlantic City, which is a six, seven hour drive. Sure. So we're centrally located. We're perfectly located in the center of the member school footprint. And from that standpoint, all of the administrators that I've talked to have said, that's where we want to go. Right, right. So, right. And, and yet so even. You're, you're hopeful. And you could say the same thing about the ECAC, right. about the home advantage because you've got Union and RPI, but they have to make it there. They have to get into the ECAC, yeah, which is four teams. Yeah, they did this year, though, yeah. Imagine if, year, if yeah, they were here, Union, Union winning that championship. That'd My guess is we would have had over 10,000 people. Oh, I, there's no question about that. Right. Uh, you, you may have been close to max right. Could have been. for that. Yeah. Could have been. The other thing that, that, that Bob has had huge success with downtown is wrestling. When you, when you get the NCAA wrestling tournaments. That was there. huge. 2002, that was the biggest economic impact for the arena for any event. Uh, we estimate about $15 million over four days was actually spent. 85% of the tickets were sold to people coming in from Nebraska and Oklahoma right. and so forth. Right. So people stayed in hotels and they spent money in the restaurants and shopping. Uh, and the Albany Convention and Visitors Bureau and the arena have put together a what we feel is a very accurate spend, which is $15 million okay. over those four days. Even the New York State High School, 1,000 people.